Hi, welcome Here to I another am. episode of Hard Mode with your president, Zachary Taylor. But the Play question remains. games on one mode and one mode only. Am I ready today to we're make back a in dying vampire. Manner, my progeny? Johnny's asking if we're ready to make a dying man our progeny, and the answer is hell no. We're going to defy the hell out of the Asylum Club, and at the very best, I'm going to eat this guy. But this guy doesn't get to become... This guy doesn't get Finally, a piece of what here, we got. Dr. Reed. What took you so long? I had to pass several of your barricades <laughs> and outposts to access your mansion, sir. And frankly, Death, sir, I'm not that interested in helping us, you. And time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, <laughs> blood transfusion equipment available. All this could be so useful in a hospital. Right? Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor a to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. And Most you can't go to the hospital. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself you wanted to feel like a doctor's the office. Paper. Very well. I'm not doing this. But before Everyone says I he's proceed, scum. I have a few questions for you. I do indeed. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. First of all, I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. Are you? I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed. Planned very carefully. I'm sure you have. Alright, let's have some details with him. We can't eat him. Ooh, and he's a pillar of this community. How? Such a dick. So I'm going to end your life. Yeah, no doubt. Do you not wish to discuss the procedure for even a minute? I right. don't have a minute to indulge in idle chatter. I can't feel my legs and the cold. So cold. Since we can't eat him, I'm going to talk him out. What about the guard? What do you know about the guard of Prewin? What I do know <laughs> is that I'll crush anyone or anything that would dare to oppose me. All right. You'll need to feed on warm blood. Right. Blood from mortals. How do you feel about that? I'm rich, Dr. Reed, and powerful. <laughs> I'm sure I'll be able to acquire all the blood I need without ever having to sully my own hands. This guy's a piece of shit. I will become your maker. Do you understand what that means? Well, I certainly won't consider you my liege or some such drivel. You can be assured of that. Well, you'd be wrong. Let's move on then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my yeah. life waning with every moment. But first, you? before you embrace immortality, Indeed. what would you do Let with me such know. a gift? That's a rather impertinent know? question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer Who me all the same. What will your first action be as an immortal? To save London. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. You mean the boroughs you're willing to help and the ones you're not? Quarantine is not a bad idea, medically speaking. But I'm convinced this epidemic will not be contained right? by mere walls. As long as the right people are on the right side of the wall, that's wow. all that matters. <laughs> oh, wow. What if a new outbreak happens inside your walls? Right. You'll have created a giant trap. That won't happen. As long as we dispose of anyone that is contaminated as soon as they are spotted. That's disgusting. But you buddy. can't guarantee infection will not spread. Just one right. contagious carrier would be enough to create an apocalypse. The apocalypse is already knocking at the gate. We must be strong now. You're wrong, Bob. That's just no humanity to this guy. I've heard enough. And it's I'm not time to proceed. Turn you if I get the chance. At last. Like if you give me All choice. Right. Do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. I've been preparing such a long time for this. Have you? Ooh. I guess we're gonna kill him. You don't deserve immortality, Mr. Dawson. No, what? sir, he does not. 
What are you prattling on about? I don't believe I've ever met a man so bereft of empathy. No, you, sir. sir, are despicable. No! I'm Wait! You can't! I made a deal with Lord Redgrave. I'll finance whatever he wants. Please just ask him. Sleep. I don't work for Rest Redgrave. Forever. Oh, satisfying. And what are they going to do? I'm about to eat a whole other neighborhood soon. As soon as our level goes up to six or whatever the hell we need. Baby, we eat everyone in town. I would have lived forever. Ascalon Club, Club Who, who are you to dead. decide my fate? I will kill you all. Who gave you the authority? I took the authority. What gave you the authority, my guy? Ooh. Mesmerization level five. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got a second key. Take some shit out of this guy's thing. Let's have a prattle around his home real quick. See if there's anything worth taking. And report to Lord Redgrave. They're really gonna make us go back and face the man after we made our decision? Oh shit, he's right here. Do you think there's any way we just walk by him. <laughs> Sup, dickhead? Is it done, Dr. Reed? <laughs> Is Aloysius Dawson reborn as expected? Alas, nope. Aloysius Dawson was not brought back to life after his death. The man is gone. What? What happened? Be straight with him. Your punk bitch friend did I not could deserve not let immortality. such a dangerous man become immortal. Not from my blood, not no, sir. for you. This is an outrage beyond words. This is betrayal, pure and simple. It is what it is, but I should kill you on the spot. You swore on William Marshall's blood. Well, you're not even with get William, William Marshall, then. so from now on his you're an outcast. Banished. You are forbidden to ever appear in front of us again. Ascalon will smite you on sight. Bring it. And your heart will be thrown to the rats. I'll leave Bring you it. then. Have fun with your puppets and shadow plays, Lord Redgrave. Yes, go, traitor. Yeah, and I'll take that you. awful creature, that counterfeit of a woman I saw waiting for you, and be gone. <laughs> this guy's got issues. Step away, traitor. Return to your dubious friends and your decrepit hospital. Do not dare show yourself <laughs> again, you or that monstrosity you bring to my door. <laughs> it's been nice knowing you, asshole. We'll meet again soon. We'll meet again soon. Oh, that guy got me fired up. What's he gonna do? You're you're the you don't even have that no nobility factor going for you. You're a punk. I'm gonna eat your whole neighborhood now. West End is the dead end. All right, everybody here. I'm gonna spare. Oh shit! I don't want to hurt Lady Ashby's Ashbury's uh, daughter. I might just have to let that one slide for now, I guess. Damn! Didn't think about that. You know who I am gonna eat is the detective fellow who's looking into our killings. <laughs> Alright, I think we gotta be smart moving forward now. Gotta eat a few people, I think, but not all the people. Like I'm surely not gonna go for Miss Ashby, Ashbury. I apologize. It's old Bridget. What's up? We meet again at the strangest of times, young Econ. So do you serve the Earl of Bristol now? Old Bridget? No, I don't what trust you. He's, doing? he's gonna come Your and try friend, to kill me real the wise hard. Econ. She sent me to warn you. Of? Did anyone see you? It's a long way from the dock sewers, and hunters are patrolling the streets here. Who said I took the streets? Right. How do you think I survived for centuries in this city without ever being seen? I know all her secrets. Good to know. How did you meet Lady Ashbury? She came to us in the sewers Good in question. search of answers. Just as you did. Oh, okay. What kind of answers did you give her? I knew nothing of your maker, but we talked. We talked a lot. Yeah. Her words and ideas are captivating. 
It is no surprise that you like her. Well, Johnny likes I like her, I'm her kind too. of just eh. Lady Ashbury in the sewers? Now that's a sight I wish I'd seen. She said she was your he friend. He says to someone that lives in there. And that she sought the identity of your maker. So I answered her questions. All right, Lady you know Ashbury. Her. You know her. We just covered that he knows her. Tell me what's going on. Her. The lady approached me but a few nights ago, wanting to meet the sewer skulls. Once she questioned Harriet Jones, she agreed Harriet, to help uh, us. Harriet Jones is still with you then? How is she doing? Harriet Hopefully remains well. angry, but is recovering slowly. Her mind is twisted, but at least her body is healing. Tell me what is going on. The lady asked us to keep an eye on your mortal doctor friend while you were away. We spotted uh, the hunters. They were discussing plans to attack tonight. Attack? No time. I shall return to my... Tell her. Do not... Alright, peace. We gotta go help out the hospital, I think. Alright, well that gives us the answer. We definitely have to eat a few people and we definitely have to... Soup ourselves up here. We gotta power up. Oh, and we got another load screen, but yeah, we're gonna have to power up and then make our way back to Pembroke Hospital, which is what I needed to do in the first place. So hopefully we can save the hospital and patients aren't dead, because if certain patients are dead, that actually changes the whole plan. Hey, detective. Doctor. What are you? I haven't. Tell me. She's a what? Do you have? No. Come with me, detective. Okay. Yeah, this way. And I think I'm gonna eat those two weird boys that are clearly like, in, in like whatever it is, mesmerized. I think to just sit there. Because he said they were waiting for someone. I think I'm the one that we're waiting for. Maybe they were just being told to wait for me so that I can uh, eat. That's how we're going to justify these actions. So you were the killer. <laughs> he thought I knew it was I me. Was right. I was indeed. Sorry, buddy. Someone just said, Dr. Reed, I'm glad to see you again. Hopefully that isn't an issue. Very good evening. Hmm. I thought they actually make you feel every second as you walk there, like, kind of like the consequence of your action. <laughs> oh, we've killed so many people. And I think we gotta slow it down in here now. But I need the strength if we're gonna go to Pembroke again and get assaulted by that doctor. Not the doctor, sorry, the guy's assaulting the doctor. <laughs> Hospital. So in the end, was it you we were waiting for? Death yes. was our destination. Yeah, actually. Ooh, hello. Four grand for this fella. Hello again. Sorry, kid. <laughs> oh, we're sick. I'm a sick, sick man. Oh, yeah, down this alley. 
It's kind of lame that the bodies go away, but I guess they'd look and be like, Oh my god, you've been feeding on everyone in the exact same spot. <laughs> Makes no sense. No sense at all. Too I bad. should have told my brother to go sooner. Sorry, kid. For a minute I thought our face looked way different, but okay. Hopefully that doesn't hurt the district too badly. Because it truly was not the goal. Now let's find our way back to our uh, new safe house that we discovered here. Have a look, see. All right, into this safe house that we haven't really utilized yet. Not much down the stairs. Haven't been up here even, I don't think yet. No, we hadn't. Got ourselves a bed. Where's our workbench? There it is. Refill all. Shillings. Alright, let's have ourselves a craft here. Down with that. Don't have enough cyber. Okay, but let's... Let's, yeah. Whatever we can here. Okay, what can we make? Let's make one of you. Not one of you because I can't afford it. I hope that just went into my inventory or something, but... As much of everything as I can make, I think. Can we upgrade the saber now? Nope, not quite there. I think, yeah, I already selected that. I believe I've already done my hacksaw one yet. Yeah. yeah. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Improve firepower. Increase shock. Ooh. Switches. Switch to fire nap. What? Do I still have the fire damage? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Do I get to upgrade for every tier then? Oh, okay, that's excellent. I didn't realize that. I really didn't, okay. Well, do I want to decrease the stamina a little bit here? Oh, that's just always going to be damage on that. But that's okay, wow, I didn't know that. We'll go and enhance handling there, and increase the damage there, and make this one a little bit more versatile. Increases damage dealt, decrease stamina consumption. I just want to decrease the stamina consumption. Just yeah. change the way I'm doing this one a little bit. I'll use the sword. Yeah, I, I, I have a game plan in mind. I have an end game in mind on that. Alright. Now, we're going to have ourselves an upgrade. Evolution. Great movie starring David Duchovny. Alright. <laughs> oh, was the health not jacked out all the way? A crime that must be must be answered. Alright. What's up this? Want to have a lot of that. And because I'm looking a couple steps ahead. Alrighty. 
see what we can do here. Let's finish you off. Because Kitty got clouds. There we go. That's hella good, I think. There you now three serums, bullets. My small 300. <laughs> Alright, now let's see these district consequences. Nervously, butthole clenches and puckers. Fuck Dawson. Damn. Oh, we screwed that. We screwed it. The only people left are the Pembroke Hospital lads. Oh no. I really thought they could take that. Well, it's looking like everyone here's gotta die. Damn. Well guys, I think our game just got a lot harder. That might have been the last big boost we're gonna get to our power level. So, I guess come back next time to see our, uh, our side quest for ourselves after hopefully saving everyone at Pembroke, because there ain't nobody left in London. We just made a big mistake. I thought that they could take it. They couldn't. If you enjoyed, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Come back next time to see if I screwed myself. Alright, peace.